If you've been thinking about getting a Cricut, this is your sign. And I'm also here to teach you how to use it. Recently, I picked up the Cricut Joy Extra, so let's do an unboxing together. I had bought it to do vinyl crafts while here in Vegas, and I'm here to tell you it does everything that I need. Came with some samples of Smart Vinyl and the transfer tape. It also came with a marker and a small mini weeding pen. And of course, the cables. The cable setup is exactly like the Cricut Maker 3. Look how cute that weeding pen is. While unwrapping it, I was just so excited to see how it was going to perform. This machine didn't come with a Cricut mat, so I just bought that separately. And that blade was so tiny so cute but anyway connecting it to the computer was so easy and i'll be walking you through this process so you go to the cricut website on the setup page it starts asking you what machine you got then cricut design space opens up here they'll ask you a series of questions just to make sure that you're setting up the right machine now the funny thing about this machine is that there isn't any buttons on it and everything is bluetooth power you want to make sure that your bluetooth is on while setting this up now at the end they ask you to do a small little project just to make sure that the machine is working perfectly and i decided to go with this black smart vinyl that was included and i have to say i think this machine is quieter than my Cricut Maker 3. Now, since there aren't any buttons on Cricut Design Space, you're gonna be selecting everything. So on your computer screen, every step of the way, you'll be selecting load, go, and unload. I was so happy that this whole process was seamless and it cut perfectly. I seriously can't wait to share more projects with you and this machine. So stay tuned for that. I hope you found this helpful.